heading to do some burnt outs today. It's like the Vernon Cruise deal here, Wichita Falls, Vernon, whatever. I don't, I don't even know. But I heard burnout and I was like, burnouts, count me in. And have one little fun night for our kiddo leaves. He's moving back to AZ. Oh, we in line, we in line. Burnout city boy. much of a burnout dude Not very long. we kind of suck all the car wanted to do was hook we put old drag radials on this stupid car and she just wanted to hook like push through the wheel chocks gosh dang it i almost ran the guy over no you ran over the wheel chocks I was oh the first yeah Blue, yeah the first pass away. yeah yeah it was a little rough what's up ryan what are you doing out here bro yeah, just you know hanging just hanging. away from home bro anyway we're gonna go home we're gonna go unload this old girl Put her back in the garage. Hey, yo, cruising in the 5-0. It's a true street car. Y'all already know. Top down, let my head blow. Oh, cheat, boys, I gotta go. No, really, I gotta go. My freaking, my freaking Uber's here. <laughs> my freaking Uber, guys. Hey, my Uber's leaving. <laughs> Ow, cheat. I think with as slow as this is going, this, this it's going super slow. I might have to run over to my credit union over here and see if I got enough money in their bank account. Oh, it is my freaking credit union. Good thing it's not very far. All right, we on our way to Weatherford to drop this old. I don't even know what you call it. Like half a car, three quarters of a car, a quarter of a car maybe. Cause it's a quarter of a car. Cause I only need the quarter, so it's a quarter of a quarter. Well, if I'm taking two quarters, because I want both quarters, I'm gonna keep the other one for a spare. So if I'm taking two quarters, is it a half? And then when I take both of those quarters and it's not the half anymore, what's left? Because it's not a whole car right now, and I'm only gonna take two quarters off of it. So what would it be? Remember that quarter of the car I was talking about? Look, old boy said he's gonna take that quarter and make old Fox Body we drive make a little look a little better. So. Yeah, it should be a little better, huh? So, that's what we got this pile of junk for. It's gonna be our demolition derby car. We're gonna LS swap it, and yep. Time to tear this cheat box apart. I, I don't know what Austin. Austin's trying to polish the turd. The more you rub it, the faster it gets, he says. It's like a genie making a wish. Anyway, now begins the journey of the makeover. So you're gonna get torn down for body and paint, new engine setup, new turbo, new turbo kit. Fix these hey, crooked bars. Baz is a little crooked. So, the whole dang thing's a, a wee bit crooked. So, we're gonna get her fixed up. 
Oh, I got everything pulled out to bottom. Now we're gonna get all this top side loosened, goosened up, and take her all out of there, boys. Come on, boy, lift it up. Eh. All right, Austin, Austin's turn. It's because there's too much travel in the suspension right now, boy. It's not a fan pole. It burns the same, bro. It's just kind of like clear, you know what I mean? Like you can't really see the flame. Yeah. This is how you load a car when it's 197 degrees outside. Oh my gosh, she's all naked. Oh my gosh, she's all naked. We ain't got no engines, Ted. We ain't got no engines. Appreciate Austin opening up his shop. Let me. Tear down this old junker here and that is help. I'm jealous. I need me a shop like this. What are you building? 7349. Yeah. Let's go check out your truck. Look at Austin's racing mobile. Tailgate to the lanes. Yeah, we got Spider-Man out here going to help us work on the car. And if, when that guy gets tired, the other one's right there. He's going to tag him in. And then he's going to help us finish. What in the hell? I don't like spiders. Not, especially not when they're the size of your hand. Nine hundred forty-seven people. I was just wondering what the heck we was doing, to old Donnie here. Well, we trying to make war in the woods. If I figure we make a public goal, then like people can roast me if I don't make it or if I get lazy. So, so we got to make a public goal. I'm trying to make war in the woods. Wire her up. Fuel system ran. We're just wiring right now. Switch panel all mounted. Boss making me a return line. Fuel cells mounted. I gotta run the main feed line now. Get all this stuff buttoned up. But yeah. Old Donnie finally getting some love. Ooh, she looking all ugly, getting dropped off for paint. Got some all steel, all glass. Her wang's gone. Where's the wang? Oh my gosh, boy. Where's the wang? The quarter panel donor. The donor car. But I bet you we cut the floor out of this thing, we could probably flood Fred Flintstone it. You know what I mean? Like, it's light enough for sure. I wish that, like, it'd be so funny if I had a motor and tranny in it because they have, like, that rednecks with those weekends coming up or in a couple weeks. Belly, bro. They let you yeah. Race it. yeah, you could. Put a motor and tranny in it and go race it in that beater race, all like how it's all like this. We were talking about it. Just pulling the roll cage on that. <laughs> all righty, all dropped off. She's going to look nice. She's all, this one's all dusty, but hopefully mine looks as good as that one. That one looks nice. Ugly, not ugly. But yep, next time you guys see this, she will, we're just gonna do bits and pieces. So she's gonna get primered, new quarter panels. He's gonna do all the body work and everything like that. Fix that front end. Take this stupid quarter that looked like Godzilla took a bite. So on the road to recovery, guys. On the road to recovery. Next time you see it, hopefully she looks a little different. Alrighty, back on the Studebaker, back on Donnie. What the hell you been doing, Dad? I was in California goofing off. What you been doing? 
Yeah, well, it's a, it's a good thing I left just in time. I don't like wiring. I am not a wiring connoisseur. Get the grid all done up. But today I got the uh, Tin Soldier race car battery box all mounted. We got the fuel system all plumbed, ran. One fitting left, but uh, she's all plumbed. Fuel, the fuel lines are all ran. Just need one connection, one fitting for the connection there and she'll be all good to go. They got the dash all mounted up there. Everything else wired, coil mounted. Got the MS he got the MSD mounted there. He got, he got the wiring just about knocked out. Headlight wires. Oh, heck yeah. I'm gonna get that seat mounted right now. I just got the bracket all done. I got the shifter mounted in there. Not long now. My, my new fucking race car has got AC in it. Your race car got AC? What's up? Yeah! Look at it. You guys hear that fan noise? 600 CFM. I don't know about that, but yes, sir. <laughs> well, I'm sure y'all can imagine. I'm ready to race something. I know it's been a while since we've given you guys an update, and honestly, I know I kind of suck at the YouTube thing sometimes. Kind of gets to be a lot though, filming everything, editing, working, traveling, doing all the stuff that I've been doing and oh man, we've done some California trips for work and stuff, which I'm excited for you guys to see the little bit of part that I got to play in the Hoonigan episode that Blonde Bully was in. Uh, man, it was awesome. Quick little trip we took to California and it'll be cool. Can't wait for that stuff to air. Uh, but anyways, like I said, just gets to be a lot and uh, ugh, took apart two cars at one time. So that was a lot. But we'll get through it. Fox will be done soon. We're getting ready to finish the Studebaker. Hopefully we'll have that done this week. So uh, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed the update. We'll have another update for you guys here with the Studebaker and hopefully testing next week. So stay tuned for that. As always, I appreciate all of y'all watching and putting up with all of my shenanigans. Don't forget to tell your friends to like, subscribe, and share.